Newport County are yet to lose to Forest Green in League Two, winning one and drawing two of the three previous clashes. Forest Green's only previous visit to Newport County in this division was a 3-3 draw in March 2018. Newport have lost four of their last five home games on Boxing Day in the league, winning the other 2-0 against Plymouth back in 2014. And this is Forest Green Rovers' first ever Boxing Day match in the EFL. Against seventh in League Two this afternoon. Plenty of the ball for Forest Green. Got a free kick as well, which they've taken quickly. The referee was content for that one to be taken. Free kick in a good position. Possible range for the strike on goal. Up and over the wall. Takes a deflection. And seeps in, it's George Williams who strikes very early for Forest Green Rovers. Well, there's no question that the nick that it took off the wall on its way through and it just altered the direction of the final strike, but nonetheless, it's a good free kick and Forest Green have the advantage. Newport will have to come from behind. Goal from range, she's clear of the crossbar. Head into the channels. Throwing for Forest Green. Have that early goal thanks to George Williams. Effort from Ray just moves through the air and they had to be equal to it in the Newport goal and was. Just locked it up and over halfway. And it's out a really good one. It's Armand inside the penalty area. We know the danger that he possesses and clips the ball into a good area in fact, but Final contact on the ball this week. Armand has actually scored three goals in Newport's last three league games against Forest Green since the start of last season. These goals have come in away fixtures. Corner kick now for Newport. Right it into the penalty. It's a pretty free header off target. Green working the ball well. That's a really clever pass. Could be an opportunity here inside the penalty area. Oh, that's a lovely dummy. How about the finish? More than equal to it. It's Campbell with a lovely individual goal. Retain his composure. They're really tight in. That provided a simple finish in the end. Certainly worth taking another look at this one because it's really well done from Campbell. The weight of the pass is superb, but just look at the composure here. First of all, the balance. Sells a great dummy, accomplished finish. understands why the referee's given the decision you could make the case of both sides really but I think the glove comes up and it isn't near the ball which is why the referee is given a penalty Harmon now in stoppage time at the end of the first half steps up and converts coolly so Newport back in it 2-1 
Set record against Forest Green. Continues that this afternoon. He's just got the goalkeeper's movement at the corner of his eye as well. Flicked on, oh, play kindly now, it's inside the area, and it's just a whisker wide for Marmont. Newport knocking at the door. Still trailing though by two goals to one. Throw in now for Newport. It's really lifted into the penalty area, stabbed away. Misdirection there, and all of a sudden, Forest Green now have an opportunity. And Butler could be in trouble here, could he? Referee has a think. And the colour is red. Newport will have to play the remainder of this game with 10 men. And let's see. It's a tangle of legs. He was racing clear, the colour is red. Fair way out for the strike on goal. Williams is over it. It's a considered run up and Williams has directed the ball expertly into the back of the net. What a stunning hit that is to George Williams, his second goal of the afternoon. And Forest Green have daylight now. It looked as though it was too far out really for the strike on goal, but he fancied his chances. Doesn't hit fully through the ball either. Just directs it so supremely well. It's Newport one, Forest Green three. George Williams on a hat trick now. Forest Green trying to find a way through. A great away performance this has been from them. Yes, they've been helped by the red car, but really played some nice stuff this afternoon. And Continuing to do so here. Effort on goal, it's another goal. And it's another great goal. And that is the hat-trick. Well, he'll remember this one for a while. George Williams scores a hat-trick for Forest Green. And the last two goals, are two goals of really great quality. This is more difficult than it looks because the ball is almost moving away from him. Arcs it in, superb. A bad boxing day for Newport. Trailing by four goals to one. To the top of the D. Could be another chance now. Forest Green Rovers are looking for five. Forest Green pushing forwards. Effort on goal, everyone wants to take it on now. That's a good save in actual fact. Squirms in favour of Newport. Still is a real passage of the game to go. Of course, Newport down to 10 men. Of course, nicely works. Effort on goal as well. Obviously wide in the end. For a screen. Still seeking more goals. They might get one here as well. It's another very, very good save from Day. He's made some big stops this afternoon. But this is really a Boxing Day afternoon that completely belongs to Forrest Green. And belongs to George Williams. His hat-trick ensures all three points go for the away side. Full-time, Newport County 1.
Forest Green for.